Hello, welcome to Fell Seal Arbiter's Mark. I am Elmeron, and we are going to continue the game. With missions. Success, hooray. So the only thing that I did between sessions this time was I came to the Restful Stones for the first time, and I found the treasure chest. Uh, it was kind of weird, there's a gravestone that's got a button on it, and you have to stand on the right side of that gravestone and press the button, and then that opens a different gravestone where the treasure chest is. I actually had to look it up because I was like, I cannot find this thing, where is this thing? Um, and what that gave me was a blood crest, which opens up the vampire class. So I can now have a vessel, a uh, werewolf, or a vampire. Uh, werewolf is the easiest, and in fact, I have made uh, Edward a werewolf. <laughs> so, you know, that's, that's happening. Um, he's got Bite, which has a chance of inflicting poison, and Leap, where they jump to a target and deal damage to all the targets around them. Um, and displace the enemies there. Um, I've actually had enemies do that to me. Um, I can do Regenerate, which uh, removes Poison, Bleed, Blind, Root, Mute, and Weaken, and grants Renew. And I can do Fetid Breath, which is a cone that has a chance to inflict Weaken, interesting, while doing damage, which is pretty handy. Um, but Regenerate sounds really amazing, so I'm going to take Regenerate for now. Um, <clears throat> it's the sort of thing that even if I uh, don't have to get rid of a status effect, uh, being able to give myself renew on a random turn, a regular turn, is pretty good. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much it. Just um, going through and doing the game, I guess. So, I guess, I guess I should... I haven't checked my um, things that I can construct recently. Craft, that's the word. Um, oh, items. I can upgrade my heavy potion to 300. That's right, I got that energized crystal. Um, I need a second one if I want to up my phoenix ashes, which I think will max them out. Maybe. Maybe. can do badges for the first time. I can make a Lunar Crest with an Energized Crystal. I can make Draconic Serum. Monster can get the Drake variant. Neat. Oh, and it lets me know, okay, so I need Dormant Crystal for the Blood Crest. I need a Dark Core for the Bone Crest, because I found those. And there's these two that I haven't found. And then there's, looks like, two two more serums that I could craft. And then gear-wise... Um, at some point I should probably go through and um, make some more of the Wayfarer's treads because they're straight-up improvements over either Toad Boots or the Running Shoes. And I can make four more of them, but uh, I'm not going to bother right now. I don't want to spend too much time doing stuff in between. In the in between, I want to go do the story. Story, story, story. Let's do story. Grimmie. Oh dear. Mysterious figure. Now would be a good time for us to walk through the door. Oh shoot. Well, that's not a good sign. Wraith. That's another one down. Just one more remains. We are so very close. Superb! It was fortunate that marked arbiter drained the floodwaters for us. What could have possessed those bazils to submerge the temple anyway? They were just trying to help. Not everyone knows or understands your purpose in visiting the temples. Speaking of Arbiters, it appears we have company. She's on her way here now. 
We have what we came for. No reason to tarry. Now, that was quick. Another drained relic. You there! Are you responsible for this? We cannot afford any delay. Grimai, if you would. As you wish, Wraith. Oh dear. Okay, those are new. Oh, a horde of demonic creatures bent on our destruction. Wish I could say I was surprised. Ever since we've been traveling together, it's been one exciting twist after another. Really gets the hemo, the hemolymph pumping. Uh, uh, pardon me? Wait, no, stop right there. Forget I asked. The energies surrounding us now are very similar to those which plagued Anadine. This Kawa is very intriguing, and also very dangerous. That cute little Kawa summoned all those things? What terrifying sorcery! Is that something they, uh, usually do? No, Anadine, it's definitely not. What? What is this? I have simply arranged for some allies to ease our departure. Do not concern yourself. The hell you say? I didn't sign up with Sigil to ally myself with whatever that thing is. Love it. Leave it. We'll handle it later. They're getting away! And at a leisurely pace at that, bastards. Nothing to be done about it. The whole horde of demons thing. Kyrie, are you alright? It's that man. He is familiar somehow. Never mind. We must focus on the task at hand, or, may, or it may be our last. No one has faced this many demonic creatures since the days before the Council, so be on guard. We have no idea what they're capable of. Defeat all foes. Okay, so what do we got? We have... A harvester. Level 20. Let's see, they've got concentration and skirmisher, counterattack, harrier, height advantage, blood mark. Stacking bonus for the, each time they attack the same target they did last time. Uh, scout, hindering hit, whirlwind, barbed blades. Okay, weak to fire and light. Weak to fire and light. You're immune to a bunch of stuff. Oh, you're skeletal, aren't you? Yeah. I recognize the uh, sub sap power. Malcubus. Weak to light. Oops. Syncubus. Also weak to light. Phantasm inflicts mind and resist down. Also deals damage if they're asleep. Sedate has a chance to sleep in a line. Good to know. Dark 2. Critical Mirage. Great. Um, so, looks like these guys are all pretty much the same. They've got some tools, some uh, items of some kind. Okay. I see, so I get three people to come over here, and I get, or up to three, and I get up to four over here, but I have five people left to choose. I think I'm actually going to leave Anadine behind for a change, because uh, these guys are all strong against dark. I mean, I guess she doesn't really do elemental for the most part, 
She just does physical, massive physical damage, but um, I think, yeah, I think I'm gonna leave her behind. Yates I'm gonna leave behind because he has dark is his major offense. So um, yeah, we'll bring Errol and uh, Nefeli and Kyukyushu. Templar's a good thing. Um, and then our secondary team will be two people over here, which may not be the best. Okay. Um, <laughs> Kyukyushu, over here. Let's see, what else could, would be good? Um, Cecil uh, does... Alicorns do some... do holy stuff, so let's bring Cecil. And... Um, I'm not sure any of the other monsters would be... would be a good idea... per se. Um... Reiner? Maybe? I guess? Sure, why not? No, wait. Better idea. Zaro, you come. Okay. <laughs> we'll see. Let's actually, let's take a quick look. Uh, Bizarro. Abilities set. We actually want you to have Holy Beast for this. Fortitude is good. Amorphous is pretty good. Absorb mana is... Yeah, that's pretty good. Currently got a Berserk equipped. Maybe do I want him to be something different actually? Um Nerva, the Vangle. Oh, I uh, killed enough cadavers in the uh, Restful Stones that he um, learned how to be a cadaver, which is a funny thing to say. Arpaya. Oops, I actually didn't mean to do that. I meant to do this. Okay, so you have poison. This gives you no weakness. And snack stash could be good. Yeah, two random buffs. Um, yeah, I'm feeling Berserk might not be the best for this one. Don't have a lot from Cadaver yet. Dow Drenner, we as we equipped that. Ursony. Ursony might be a good actually let's do Ursony, because that's Sacred Bolt. That's holy damage. Yeah. I guess I could bring Maya, my actual Ursony. Um There it is. Um but Yeah, I think I've got a good team. I think this will do. Alright, give it a shot. Let's see how we go. Alright, let's focus. Focus. And we'll wait. We'll go there. So that you can move here. Alright. Oh, uh, there? Is that enough? Just three. Ah, so close. It's like, oh, I can do, I can get haste on these people right away. No. Nope. Oh well. Maybe next time. I for, I, I keep forgetting that it costs fourteen. And you start with 10. <laughs> and so, um, so Cecil has to move to get enough MP for that. Okay. Um, I don't suppose I've got anything that would that's ranged. Well, that's ranged. I mean to poison. That's holy damage. 
Sure. Ursini can kindling. I like that it's kindling because they're phoenixes. And phoenixes burn. Right? It's fun. Alright. I don't really know how bad this is going to be. Oh, you fly. Ow. Oh, I didn't like that. Uh, I like how he changes appearance so that it looks like the monster. I guess... Is Bizarro a he? Maybe it's they. I like how they change appearance to match the monster they are. Um... ones don't have elemental resistances. Uh, well, they only, they're only weak to uh, light holy damage. Um, yeah, I suppose, you know, you hit me. I don't appreciate it. I don't appreciate that, so take this. Goodness, that hurt. Well, right, po potions. They're good potions, too, so these ones might have Phoenix Ashes as well. Close enough to heal. Yeah. Yep. Wait, I have nature healing. Ah. Uh, oh, wait. Haha. -ha. There we go. I can get a little bit of healing in. Sal Sprout has really good range. Okay. Um, they all went the wrong way. Alright, let's get Errol some help. Okay, let's just kill this thing. How's that? There you go. Errol, you're safe now. Ish. You're safe-ish. Oh, yep, there it is, the Phoenix Ashes. Okay. <laughs> I don't like it, and I think you should slow down. I really like Counter Slow. It's so good. Ow. Get some MP by running. Yeah, too too far away. So let's <clears throat> I 
keep our healing up. out of us another one as long as long as there's a spot for it. I think that's what's happening. I, you know, didn't read it very closely. <laughs> um, yeah. I think you should just take some holy damage. That's what I think. Fire damage, it's not going to kill you. It will kill you. Oh, hi. Oh, it's like, who are you attacking? Oh, I bet, I bet this is weak to dark from the Arsene. Uh, of course, okay. That's actually good, uh, because it lets uh, Cecil run walk next to you, and he can one-shot you, like so. Yeah. Okay, not a fan. this takes me. Yep. Yep. Takes me there. Stop it. I do not appreciate it. No resistance to earth or lightning. So not a lot of damage, but it's something. Hi there. I have a scythe. Nice. Um, yeah, Bizarro, you're just gonna spend a lot of time keeping yourself alive, I guess. These these I mean, these demons have your number. Unfortunately for them. Cecil kind of also has their number. Um, I don't 
think I can hit you from here. No. Well, that's okay. We'll just we'll just wait. That's right, you're a wizard right now. Which is certainly helping your ability to hit things. And we'll focus. Again, no, no weakness, no resistance, rather, to um, Earth or Thunder. And this will finish it. Gotcha. Jammy fruit. Ooh, another energized crystal. A dark silk robe. Malcubus class was unlocked for Bizarro. Fantastic. I don't have to worry about that again. <laughs> First we had to defeat the demonic Alphonse, and now we fought a score of them. Something must be seriously wrong with the pilgrimage. I think this had more to do with that Kawa, Grimai, than the pilgrimage. If I was a gambling man, I'd wager that Kawa and the leader of Sigil were behind every weird thing that's been happening with the relics. Hmm, are you in not in fact a gambling man? No, uh, touche. I agree, those two are extremely suspicious. But I can't picture Alphonse working hand-in-hand -hand with Sigil members. Their goal is to strip the Council of its power, which would negate his noble status. Unless he was playing for even bigger stakes. There is certainly more at play here. That does seem to be the way of things these days. Now that we know Sigil members have been draining the relics for some nefarious purpose, what are we going to do about it? The Council is already aware, of, already aware of the threat posed by Sigil, and we still know precious little about their larger plan. Therefore, we stay the course and proceed to the next temple. Makes sense. I bet the Sigil members are headed that way as well. But first... Kyrie, just be careful, all right? It is done. The dark energy feels somewhat stronger than before, but I'm adjusting to it. Let's be on our way. The last temple awaits. The final temple is deep within Kawa lands, so you'll get to see plenty of the little folk, Anadine. Wow, I wasn't actually expecting to go that way. Interesting. So we've got the Fogamouth, Fogamouth Bogs, the Strangled Cove. Uh, did anything else go up in levels? Let's see. Two to five, four to eight. Okay, still about the same. And then Fenfjord and Port Grendel. So I bet the last temple is down here, actually. Which is a shame. I kind of wanted to go see the Frozen North. All right, there's an event. Captain, a moment if you please. 
Yes, go ahead. I want to talk to you about the demons we encountered in the temple. They are called Malkibai. They are denizens of the demonic realm and never strayed from there without outside help. Without being summoned, you mean? Exactly. Did you notice anything familiar about them? I'm not sure what you mean. My apologies. I tend to forget that mine are the only trained eyes. There were many similarities between those foul creatures and the demonic form which overcame Anadine outside my cabin. In the excitement of the battle, I didn't put it together. But yes, I see that now. As a younger man, I traveled in the lands of the Kawas, studying healing and magic. I learned much from the Kawas, including the skills to craft the amulet we used to stifle the dark energy inside Anadine. Of demon summoning, I saw and read nothing. That is curious. More than curious, I'd say. What is the connection between this grim eyes demons and Anadine's corruption? Where did he learn such dark magic? The level of skill needed to summon this many demons, seemingly at will. It would be difficult to achieve without a mentor, someone who by definition must be that much more powerful. Mm. Well, I don't want to trouble you further with idle speculation. Our conversations do tend to be troubling, Yates, but thank you for bringing this to me. Alrighty then. Ominous. Very ominous. Okay, well, I'm going to call it there for now. So, um, thank you for watching the episode. I hope you enjoyed. I will talk to you next time. Bye for now.